Ah, do you remember that magical moment when you stumbled upon the 1988 TV series Empty Nest? The feeling of curiosity and intrigue as you embarked on a journey into the lives of the Harper family and their delightfully quirky neighbors. It's as if time paused and you were transported into their world, a place where laughter echoed through the halls of the Harper household and heartwarming memories were etched into the tapestry of your own recollections. Maybe it was that unforgettable scene where the ever-charming Richard Mulligan portrayed Dr. Harry Weston, trying to balance his demanding career as a pediatrician while navigating the humorous mishaps of his grown daughters and the eccentric, yet endearing, next-door neighbor, Charlie. Or perhaps it was the way the show skillfully blended humor with touching moments, creating a bittersweet symphony that resonated deep within your soul. As you reflect on those moments, you can't help but smile at the unforgettable characters and the laughter that became your own. And now, as we delve into some captivating random facts about the show, you'll find yourself discovering new layers to the narrative that once captivated your heart and mind. Did you know that Empty Nest was a spin-off of another beloved sitcom, The Golden Girls? It's fascinating how a mere thread of connection can lead to a whole new universe of entertainment. And let's not forget about the talented cast that brought these characters to life, each one weaving their own unique magic into the tapestry of the show. So, as we journey through these intriguing tidbits, take a moment to let your mind wander back to those initial encounters with the show and the countless memories that have remained etched in the sands of time. After all, Empty Nest wasn't just a show. It was a doorway to a world of laughter, love, and relatable chaos. And now, without further ado, let's dive into some delightful random facts about the show, shedding light on the hidden gems that make Empty Nest a true classic. So sit back, relax, and let the nostalgia wash over you as we uncover the secrets that make this series an enduring favorite. 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 Southern charm and canine companions, unveiling the quirks of Empty Nest in the quaint yet bustling world of the late 80 seconds TV hit Empty Nest. One couldn't help but be captivated by the eccentricities that colored the lives of its beloved characters. Among these quirks was the charming southern accent of Nurse Lavern Todd brought to life by the equally Southern Park overall. Hailing from Horse Creek, Tennessee, overall seamlessly blended her own origins with her characters, lending a touch of authenticity to the show's medical milieu. However, Empty Nest wasn't all about steady familiarity. While Bear the Dog remained a loyal presence throughout the series' entire run, there were instances where his wagging tail took a brief hiatus from the screen. These intermittent disappearances kept audiences on their toes, a testament to the show's ability to surprise even amidst the comfort of its well-established dynamics. The show's keen eye for guest appearances further added to its allure. Notably, stars from the sitcom Nurses, David Rash and Loni Anderson, graced the empty nest universe with their presence. This crossover not only showcased the interconnectedness of the TV landscape, but also served as a delightful treat for fans of both shows, bridging the gap between two distinct yet interwoven narratives. As we reflect on the peculiar charms of Empty Nest, it becomes clear that the show's strength lay in its ability to blend the ordinary with the unexpected. From Nurse Lavern's heartfelt southern drawl to Bear's intermittent vanishing acts, the series found beauty in the balance of consistency and surprise. And as we revisit this bygone era of television, we're reminded that sometimes, it's the quirks that make a show truly unforgettable. Forgettable. Forgettable. Empty nest, unveiling behind-the-scenes canine talent in the annals of television history. Few series have woven their way into the fabric of American homes like Empty Nest. Premiering in 1988, the show followed the escapades of widowed pediatrician Harry Weston, played by the charismatic Richard Mulligan, as he navigated life after his children left the nest. However, amidst the human talent, it's the canine prowess that often goes unnoticed. Bear the dog, an endearing golden retriever, endeared himself to viewers as Dreyfus, Harry's faithful and lovable pet. But here's where the plot thickens, Bear's four-legged brother, Julio, played an integral role behind the scenes. In those charming opening credits of the show's earlier seasons, it was actually Julio who energetically frolicked alongside Richard Mulligan. When Dreyfus had to tackle more action-packed scenes, Julio was the one racing around, bringing an extra dose of vitality to the screen. The camaraderie between Julio and Mulligan was palpable, infusing an authentic dynamic into the show's ethos. 
Bear, while undoubtedly charming, often took a more laid-back approach, leaving the stage for Julio's exuberant antics to shine. Yet, while Bear and Julio added a dash of canine charm to Empty Nest, the human cast held their own. Remarkably, five original cast members remained steadfast throughout the show's entire run. However, it's worth noting that only Richard Mulligan, the heart and soul of the series, graced the screen in all 170 episodes. Fast forward to 2014, when David Rash, who breathed life into the character of Jack Trenton, surprised fans by resurrecting his role for the movie Amira and Sam. It's a testament to the enduring allure of empty nest that characters and memories continued to resonate years after the final curtain call. In a world where television landscapes evolve rapidly, Empty Nest stands as a touchstone to an era of endearing narratives, loyal companions, and the steadfast actors who brought them to life. So, the next time you catch a glimpse of Dreyfus wagging his tail or Jack Trenton's signature smile, remember the tales behind the scenes that added layers to a show cherished by many. Cherished by many. In the annals of television history, the 1988 TV series Empty Nest stands as a memorable and often heartwarming depiction of family life, brimming with its own share of backstage tales. One such narrative revolves around Park Overall, the actress who portrayed Laverne Todd. In a resolute stand against perpetuating Southern stereotypes, Overall adamantly declined to utter lines that she deemed as facile jokes about Southerners. Her principled stance led to fervent clashes with the show's writers, resulting in a character that defied caricature. However, the show was not untouched by the challenges of reality. During its fifth season, a significant turn of events occurred when Christy McNichol, a prominent cast member, withdrew from the series. Diagnosed with bipolar disorder, McNichol's departure underscored the complexities of mental health even in the glittering world of showbiz. Yet, like a phoenix, she made a triumphant return in the series' final episode, providing both the show and its fans with a poignant denouement. Behind the scenes, producers displayed an uncanny foresight. To preemptively address the potential departure of either McNichol or Dinah Madoff, they ingeniously conceived the character of Emily as an off-screen presence. This strategic maneuver established a safety net, a familiar third sister primed for introduction as a seamless replacement. This tactical move, unseen by the audience, illuminated the delicate balancing act of TV production. As the curtain closed on Empty Nest, its legacy was firmly established in the tapestry of television history. The series grappled with authenticity, weathered real-world tribulations, and orchestrated narrative backflips behind the scenes. Ultimately, it was a reminder that even amidst the laughter and the scripted drama, the human spirit's resilience weaved its own narrative, one that mirrored the tales unfolding on screen. And so, the echoes of Empty Nest continue to resonate, a testament to the intricacies of performance, the art of storytelling, and the indomitable human resolve. And resolve. And resolve. And Empty Nest, the 1988 TV series, left an indelible mark on the sitcom landscape, defying expectations with its lasting legacy. Running a remarkable seven years, a feat comparable to both Benson and the Golden Girls, it marked the final wit, Thomas, Harris production of its era. This comedic gem not only showcased the wit and humor of creator Susan Harris, but also brought together a cast with intriguing connections. Richard Mulligan and Dinah Madoff, who graced the screen in Empty Nest, were no strangers to the comedic genius of Susan Harris. Both had previously starred in ABC's groundbreaking show, Soap, another creation of Harris. This shared history lent a unique chemistry to their performances, adding layers of familiarity to the show's dynamics. Adding to the ensemble was the captivating Grace Zabriskie, who portrayed Eva, Harry's charming love interest, in the series' inaugural episode. Remarkably, Zabriskie's journey came full circle as she reappeared seven years later in the season finale, this time as Scarlet, Lavern's mother. Such intricate interweaving of characters showcased the creator's commitment to crafting a rich and interconnected narrative. Empty Nest remains a testament to the enduring power of a well-crafted sitcom, boasting a longevity that paralleled its predecessors. With Harris genius at the helm and a cast with shared history, the show defied conventions and brought laughter to households for an impressive seven-year run. From unexpected connections to intricate character arcs, Empty Nest showcased the art of storytelling in the world of comedy. And so, the legacy of Empty Nest lives on, reminding us that even in the realm of television, 
The bonds created on and off screen can be as enduring as the laughter they inspire. Twitter they inspire. Twitter they inspire. Lavern and Sandy, a cross series friendship blossoms in the bustling world of 1988 television. One relationship shone as an unexpected beacon of camaraderie. Lavern Todd, portrayed by the ever talented Stephanie Hodge, found herself in the heart of the medical sitcom Nurses. However, it wasn't just her on screen camaraderie that caught our attention. Lavern's bond with her fellow nurse, Sandy Miller, played by none other than Stephanie Hodge, crossed the boundaries of their respective shows. The series' empty nest proved to be the shared universe, paving the way for this connection. Stephanie Hodge's portrayal of Sandy Miller in Nurses created a unique bridge between the two shows. While the focus of Nurses centered on the dynamic within a hospital, Empty Nest spotlighted the life of Dr. Harry Weston and his daughters, providing an alternative narrative. Lavern and Sandy's friendship managed to transcend the confines of their distinct storylines, capturing the essence of camaraderie that television aficionados craved. This connection between the characters was grounded in a tangible bond off-screen. The rapport between Hodge and her co-stars on Empty Nest facilitated the crossover. Their shared experiences, both in the world of acting and the complexities of building a series from the ground up, fostered a genuine friendship that extended beyond the scripts. The convergence of empty nest and nurses symbolized the interconnectedness of television narratives. While the shows revolved around disparate themes, the seamless interaction between Lavern and Sandy underscored the synergy between the creative minds behind these series. It's a testament to the rich storytelling landscape of 1988 that such unique alliances could flourish, bridging gaps that the audience hadn't even known existed. In a world where entertainment often remains compartmentalized, the bond between Lavern and Sandy reminds us of the power of unexpected connections. Stephanie Hodge's dual roles encapsulate the spirit of an era where characters could stretch beyond their designated boundaries, inviting audiences to explore uncharted territory. As we revisit these shows today, it's this camaraderie, both on screen and off, that continues to captivate us, making the legacy of Empty Nest an indelible part of television history. As we bid adieu to the nostalgic journey through the 1988 TV series Empty Nest, it's like folding the pages of a cherished photo album filled with laughter, love, and life lessons. As the last scene fades to black, the characters become more than just names on a screen. They are old friends who shared their triumphs and tribulations, reminding us of our own joys and struggles. Like an evergreen tree, Empty Nest stands tall in the landscape of our memories, its branches laden with moments that have weathered the test of time. This series wasn't just about a talented cast delivering witty lines and heartfelt moments. It was an unspoken pact between creators and viewers. It gave us permission to explore the complexities of family dynamics, to laugh at life's quirks, and to shed a tear when the heartstrings were gently tuned. As you reflect on your personal journey with Empty Nest, think of the episodes that made you laugh till your sides ached and the ones that made you pause and ponder. Those memories are yours to hold on to, and your connection with the show is as unique as your fingerprint. But this journey doesn't have to end here. Share your favorite memories, the episodes that resonate with you the most, and the lessons that still echo in your heart. Let's weave a tapestry of experiences that pays homage to a show that brought warmth into our homes and taught us that amidst life's emptiness, we could find a nest filled with love and laughter. So, dear friend, as we wrap up this stroll down memory lane, I want to thank you for allowing Empty Nest to be a part of your life, for embracing its characters as kindred spirits, and for holding on to the moments that continue to light up your soul. Your connection to the show is a testament to the power of storytelling and its ability to bridge the gaps between generations and time itself. With gratitude for your time and interest, pressed, 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 pressed.